No. The, the same drug that we were using in the pediatric Crohn's, we're actually looking at its ability to ameliorate some of the gastrointestinal problems associated with the acute radiation syndrome. Um, again, thinking about this from a biodefense standpoint, if someone were to set off a nuclear device, God forbid, um, we know that there is a very stereotypic sort of response which happens in, in people. The first is your blood system sort of falls apart, but the next system to go is the GI. And again, one of the problems with using systemic steroids in these patients is that it causes immunosuppression generally, which increases the risk of infection, which is a big problem with radiation sickness. So that our drug allows us to get that anti-inflammatory activity of a steroid in the GI system without necessarily increasing substantially the risk of infection. So we're working with both, well, with NIAID and BARDA, uh, two of the funding agencies of our government, uh, looking at this particular drug uh, in response to that sort of scenario.